Before I let you go, I want to hit one more thing. Um, and it's actually not about Planned Parenthood, which is, which is good. Um, you actually wrote recently, I think it was for Dame Again, about how Republicans may actually be moving past Planned Parenthood as their main fight. Um, and this is something to really keep an eye on uh, and, and to be aware of because it's, it's again, another uh, thing where Republicans are trying to take inch by inch when they, when they go and try to take a away a woman's right to, to an abortion. So tell us about it. Mm -hmm. um, what is going on is the fact that a lot of what the whole video release from Center for Independent Media was doing is trying to get really graphic looking abortion images in front of a general audience and in front of the American people. We who work in reproductive rights see these all the time because they're in front of clinics. Um, some groups even like to bring them to big public outings in order to shock people and make them face the reality of it. Um, but what the videos have done has opened up a way for anti-abortion activists to talk in very gruesome detail and to show very gruesome pictures about what happens in an abortion. What this has done has capitalized on a bill that passed both in Kansas and in Oklahoma over the summer, which bans abortion essentially after the first trimester. It's a particular kind of abortion procedure, a D&E. Um, and what they're calling it is dismemberment abortion. And so at 14 weeks, this is the way that most abortions are done in order to make sure that, that, um, all of the fetus is removed and all of that. So Kansas has so far had the law blocked. Oklahoma's law goes into effect. Oh, Hey, Oklahoma's law goes into effect on Thursday. I'm assuming that will be blocked as well. Mm -hmm. And, but what has happened is that federally they have introduced a ban, a federal dismemberment ban, which is banning a DNE. If this happened, then what it would do is essentially end all abortion at between 12 and 14 weeks gestation. That is devastating. Most people, first of all, don't even find out that they're pregnant until at least four or six weeks on. Um, we have um, five states, well, we have. We have five states. We're back down to five now that only have one abortion clinic there at all. Like you have waiting periods already. You have waits to get into the clinic when you actually have have to get an appointment. Abortion is starting to become later and later because of the amount of money that's necessary, because it's not publicly funded, because of how long it takes to get to a clinic, waiting periods, all of this. And now they're working on narrowing the window in which you can legally get an abortion. This is beyond the 20-week abortion ban. This is essentially a ban on abortion at 14 weeks with no means of getting around it. There's There won't be a rape section. There won't be anything for the health of, a, of a, the person who's carrying that pregnancy. And this is what they're trying to do next because they want to make the window as small as possible because they can't make abortion outright illegal. So two states and there's an injunction. One state has an injunction. The other oh, one probably will because it's going into yeah. effect Thursday. Likely. Yeah. Yes. Hopefully knock on, knock on wood. So then are other states pushing, other states are pushing this forward. Uh, this is, this is something that's, that's. There that's, are a couple of states that introduced it last year, but mm -hmm. it never got a hearing. Missouri was one of them. North Carolina was one of them as well. My guess is that there are going to be a lot more of them. We will see a number of them happen in January or February. The only thing that could put this on pause for a little bit is the fact that we are heading into an election year and it's a presidential election year, which means a lot more voters. We tend to see less really extreme abortion restrictions passed in state legislatures on the year that there is a big presidential election.